some of the bigger more concentrated areas I, of, a, of a city like new york uh, i am banned from facebook so i have to kind of uh, make a video now and uh, probably put it later on when i'm allowed to put it on my opinion about all this uh, coronavirus is not funny. This is a revolution of the Communist Party with congestion of liberals and globalists of the United States, including DNC, to topple America and get rid of the United States. We see all the signs. All of a sudden, the new Green Deal comes along. Free healthcare. And all the stuff that the Democrats are talking about. So basically, if you look at it, this is all planned by China. And how is planned by China with the globalists and the Democrat here in the United States? To break the back of the United States economically. This is a World War Three. World War Three is different than many people thought. No missiles, no soldiers, no tanks, no ships. Nothing involved for whatever we know and billions of dollars, maybe trillions, are expanded in the United States to protect the country. With the little tiny virus that they created, they basically, China trying to get over the world. And the way it looked like, they won't, I hope. Americans are too naive and stupid to understand what communism can do to humanity. But the good would get over the evil. And maybe that's God's plan to diminish the evil on earth. Meaning regimes like China, Russia, North Korea, Iran, and all the other brutal dictatorship and communist that are ruling the world and trying to take over now. So this is a revolution actually of uh, Sanders. Sanders has been talking about it, to change the system, to change America. And the uh, Chinese are too smart. And uh, they actually hand by hand, they trying to topple the United States of America that right now is managed by Donald Trump. Donald Trump is a naive man, is a builder, is not a politician. I don't know if he sees what's happening around him, unfortunately, but I think his eyes getting open and understanding that the $250 billion that he claimed that we're gonna gain from a trade with China is nothing compared 20 or 30 trillion dollars that this economy now damaged by them. What is 250 billion compared to 30 trillion dollar damage to United States economy? I know for sure we will prevail, but it's gonna take long time unless United States with the rest of the world would rise against the communism like Reagan did and call them whatever they are, the evil empire. The evil empire of China unfortunately succeeded to create a chaos and a death around the world. For China, if 20 or 30 or 40 or 100 million people dead, doesn't make any difference. If you look at their history, they killed millions of their own people without mercy. So for them, 
thousand or five thousand or ten thousand human life is basically nothing. Basically nothing. So they're willing to sacrifice maybe half of the population. For them then it's easier to roll over every other country like they're doing it in Africa and they're doing it in Asia. And then our freedom is gone, gone, dead. America that we know, the free world that we know will not exist again. This is their dream, but I hope they're not gonna succeed. This is my speech for today.